hello friends welcome to saturday i want to do a little self-care night it's about like 4 p.m on saturday and yeah i want to do a little self-care night with you guys because i don't think we've ever done that on um a vlog before also i found this camera right and i was like maybe i can vlog off of it or just record videos in general with it the camera quality of it not good like i thought it would be a lot better considering like i use my phone to vlog as you guys know and i was like okay using a camera would probably be better than my phone quality but surprisingly enough it really isn't so we're gonna stick with phone vlogs for a little bit longer <laughs> and i hope you guys enjoy but yeah i'm gonna take you along the evening with me and we're gonna do some self-care stuff we may might play some games and whatnot i also want to start that book journal with you guys because i do have a journal and we're gonna do yeah some journaling and stuff like that <laughs> I am watching some Twitch streams. I am modding for both my cousin and my partner. Um, they are both streaming currently, so I am modding for them for a little bit. But in the meantime, I think we should start our journal. So this is what the setup's looking like. We have our cute little journal. We have book ideas. We have both of the streams up. So let's get started. Okay, so this is the current setup. I have both of the streams up. We have a cute little mushroom notebook that I've used slightly. I opened it and I was like, what is in here? And it's just a like travel checklist from a trip I went on, but literally nothing else. So we're gonna convert this into our cute little book journal. And I have my iPad here set up with um, a ton of little ideas for the book journal. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get started on that and I'll bring you through it once I've gotten a few pages laid out. Also, a little disclaimer, this is not gonna be the most aesthetic book journal you've probably ever seen because it's my first time doing it. But regardless, I'm excited. <laughs> So I started the first page and I did some of it. I've been seeing this like layout for pages on a lot of people um, who do like reading vlogs and stuff like that. Like Haley Fam has done it, Cozy Games has done it, and I really liked it. So I'm not gonna lie, I tried to do it. This is the like books I've read this year so far. It's a little bookshelf. Also, don't look at this pot. I don't want to talk about it. It looks horrible. But I filled in all of the books that I've read this year so far, and the other books are my goal for the rest of the year. And then I left some open spaces, like down here, we could add another bookshelf and stuff if I end up reading more books than what we have. And then I actually, okay, so halfway through this, I decided I kind of want to take this book journal seriously. I didn't think I was going to, but then I started looking at how other people do theirs and like I kind of want like a really cute title page and like print it out and like put it in here. Like I kind of want to do more than just this little thing. But that also requires effort and I don't know if I'm going to want to apply the same effort throughout the entire book. Because I feel like if I try really hard for every single page, it's never going to get finished or written in. So, I am debating it. <laughs> but for right now, I might add another page, like um, a to-be-read list or books I want to read for the rest of the year and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, I'll let you know what else I do. And then we are probably either gonna play some games or start our little self-care night. Okay, hello. I did the second page. It's not as cute. It's just a little wish list of books with like a little check mark. I wanna get cute stickers too. <laughs> like I have some stickers that I'm gonna look through and see if I wanna add. 
but like there's so many cute aesthetic sticker sheets on like Etsy and stuff and yeah I'm really debating it but it's about five o'clock right now I am going to go see if me and my dad want to pre-order Tears of the Kingdom because it's something we've talked about for a little bit and then I think I'm gonna eat dinner and after that we are gonna start our self-care night <laughs> officially some self-care time <clears throat> jesus my throat <laughs> um i am gonna find a cozy outfit and then i think what i want to do is do some skincare maybe do a little face mask maybe do some journaling and then honestly that's kind of <laughs> the extent of my self-care i'm gonna go ahead and say gaming is self-care because I started playing Coffee Talk earlier, as you saw, and I've never fully played through Coffee Talk. And I kind of just want to continue it, and I also kind of want to play some Stardew Valley tonight. So, that is the plan for right now. I also have a book to finish tonight, which I'm really excited about. I finally got the book from the last vlog. And I'm almost done with it. It was really, really good. For anyone who hasn't read the Dance of Thieves duology, um, I would highly recommend it. It's really, really good. And I'm kind of sad that I'm going to finish it tonight because I just, I wish there was a third book in the series or like something more to read from the series because I really like the characters. The story is really good and I just feel like it shouldn't be ending yet, like, I don't know, I'm sad about it. But yeah, I'm gonna start getting it ready in for self-care. I made some tea. I made a mistake. Right before I started this, I set my tea right on my mouse pad. And now there's like a... I want to say it's a ring spot, but it's just... It's my mouse pad. Anyways, it's dirty. Um, for the rest of the night, I kind of just want to play some games and relax and spend some time with my partner. So... I kind of think this is where it's going to be for the self-care stuff, but tonight I am going to finish my book. 100%. So in the morning, before I edit and post this video and stuff like that, I will let you guys know my thoughts on my book. It is Sunday morning, and I did finish A Vow of Thieves last night. But, so I started watching TikToks last night after finishing the book, so I was like, this book is so good, is there anything similar and stuff like that? And apparently there's a trilogy that you're supposed to read before you read the Dance of Thieves duology, which I didn't know about. So, though the books were amazing, there were a few characters who popped in who I didn't exactly know. But it was still amazing. I think I rated it 5 out of 5 stars. I would 100% recommend to anyone. And I don't think you have to read the trilogy beforehand. It might be a trilogy. There might be more books in it. But there's other books you're supposed to read before <laughs> the Dance of Thieves books, but I would still recommend it to anyone. It's such a good book. But yeah, I think that is where I'm going to end this little vlog. I know I said it was a self-care vlog and it ended up just being me doing like a face mask and stuff and playing games and whatnot, but I still hope you enjoyed nonetheless and I will see you guys next week and as always, 
make sure you like and subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you next time bye <laughs>